Friends, happy Friday. Welcome back to the show. Sally Hearts Jack 80 here, and this is the Sally Hearts Jack 80 show. How are my lovey subbies on this wonderful, fabulous Friday? We have finally made it to the to Friday, guys. And let me tell you, I'm glad we've made it to Friday because I am exhausted. <laughs> so last night I stayed up really late because I went to go see Pride and Prejudice and Zombies, which was super, super amazing. And I love, 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 loved it. And so I'm really, really tired because it kind of scared me and I couldn't sleep. <laughs> I know, right? Which is so bizarre because... I love zombie films. I love George A. Romero. I love Night of the Living Dead. I love The Walking Dead. And I gotta say, I was not, I did not want to see this film. I did not want to see it at all, but I'm glad that I went because I really, really loved it. Let me just say, I thought Poe Dameron was my hero, but I gotta say, Lily James kicked major zombie bootay in this film, and I, I love her. I gotta say, she's my hero. Lily James for president. <laughs> okay, maybe not. But um, she was super, super cool, guys. It was a really, really good movie. It was really creepy. Um, I'm not gonna say anything about it. I'm not gonna do any spoilers. I'm not gonna tell you anything. I'm just gonna say it's really, really amazing. It's really, really good. And I loved the whole cast. They were amazing. But I really, really loved Lily James. She was fabulous. And now I have to watch Cinderella. Because I didn't watch the live version of Cinderella. And now I feel really silly for not seeing it. Because I gotta tell you, I loved Lily. Lily was amazing. Can I get another Lily doll, a Pride and Prejudice and Zombies Lily doll, where she's Elizabeth Bennet? Such a super, super huge character. And I love the movie for that reason, because it was like, women can be heroes too. Women can be the brave ones. They can get the job done. And let me just say... If I was in a zombie apocalypse, it would be, my dream team would be Daryl Dixon and Lily James <laughs> because she kicked butt. Like, that girl was amazing in that film. And I just gotta say, I'm glad. I'm glad that they're making a film that, they, they're making films that show girls and women as the hero, just like I love that Star Wars, you know, Ray kicks major butt. I loved Ray. Um, Daisy Ridley, man. Amazing. Another amazing example. So, this weekend, this Friday night, if you're not busy, definitely go check out Pride and Prejudice and Zombies because you will love it. It is amazing. It's got a few little jump scares in it, um, but it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool how they kill the zombies. And the zombie effects are really, really awesome in the film, too. They're creepy. Um, oh, man, I don't want to say anything. But anyway, guys, go see it. You will love it. And go support our girl, Lily James, because she is fabulous. Well, when I was at the film, I ended up going across the way because uh, next to the theater is a Barnes & Noble. And I haven't been in Barnes & Noble in forever. I know. I love to read. But, um... I just never think about going to Barnes & Noble. Usually I go to like secondhand stores to get books or I order them on Amazon. But anyway, I decided to go in and I'm glad I did because I found this cute Funko Pop set with Princess Tiana and Naveen as the frog. How cute is this? I didn't even know that this was out, you guys. Did you guys know this set was out, this Funko Pop set? It's super, super cute. It is the first time I've ever seen Tiana as a Funko Pop. Has she been a Funko Pop before, guys? I'm pretty sure she has. But I think it's really, really cute that it comes with the little Naveen. And on the back, it has um, Louie and Dr. Facilier, which I do not like him because he's a creeper creepy. Um, but this was so super cute. And it was $8.95. I swear, Barnes & Noble has the cheapest prices on Funko Pops. Ever. Because um, everywhere else, they're like $11.95, $12.95. Hot Topic has them for like $12.95. And it's insane. I mean, they're cute and they're super, super adorable. And I'm definitely a fan of them. But $8.95 is totally a super good deal. So if you're looking for Funko Pops, guys, and you don't want to pay a huge amount of money, definitely check out Barnes & Noble. Because $8.95 is awesome. Okay. 
Oh, and one more thing before I go. While I was at Barnes & Noble, I happened to cross their clearance bin, and it was the red dot bin. Everything in it was $2, and y'all won't believe what I found. Speaking of zombies, speaking of my new hero, Lily James, zombie killer. Can she be on The Walking Dead? Hello. But anyway, I found this Rick Grimes bobblehead. There's absolutely nothing wrong with him, and I got him for 2 bucks, you guys. How cool was that? And I almost didn't even see him and I passed him up completely but I just could not believe that he was two dollars look at that glare oh total glare two dollars which is so super amazing let me pull him out because I'm going to pull him out anyway and I want you guys to see him without the glare but how cool is that He's like super, super cool. And this is the first Rick Grimes bobblehead that I've ever got, that I bought ever. So he's super, super adorable. And I do love Rick Grimes. He is my, well, I think I love him, Carol, and Daryl. They are my favorites from the, oh, how dare I not include Michonne, whom I love. Okay, guys, anyway, I don't have any favorites on The Walking Dead because I love them all equally. I know, it's crazy. But I can't single any of them out. And I feel bad without them being there. So I hope they stop killing them off. But anyway, so that is the finds that I found last night, Thursday night, when I was out seeing Pride and Prejudice and Zombies, which was amazing. Check that out this weekend, guys. And check out Barnes & Noble for your Funko Pop needs. Love it. Thank you, Barnes & Noble, for selling these at an awesome price. Princess Tiana and Naveen, so super cute. So thank you guys, my lovely subbies, for tuning in for this Friday's fabulous show. I hope you guys enjoyed it. You know what? I'm going to take a nap. As soon as I wrap this show up, I'm taking a nap. <laughs> At least I hope so, but who knows what's going on. I hope you guys are having a wonderful weekend so far, a wonderful Friday. And hey, take a nap if you need to relax, guys. Because who knows how busy your guys' week was. And we just want to enjoy ourselves and have a little peace and quiet this weekend. So thank you guys so much. Remember to love your family, love your friends. But most importantly, love yourself. Be kind, stay Stay positive, and until we meet again in this, I'm so glad there's no such thing as zombie apocalypse world. <laughs> you guys have a magical day, and I will see you for tomorrow's Saturday shout-out show. Have fun, guys. Continue to enjoy your Friday. Bye-bye.